Welcome to 60 Skills. Today's lecture is using meditation to improve Wiccan magical ceremonies. All right, many people get into Wicca and find both a religion and a magical system that meets their day-to-day -day needs. Now, Wicca in general draws most of its material from the Golden Dawn and Hermetic Canon in terms of ritual magic. So it's mostly a ritual magic system. And this works great. The rituals are quite powerful and in most cases really fulfill a need for most of its practitioners. However, what a lot of people run into is at a certain point, they either can't generate enough energy or they can't generate enough of something to take their rituals to the next level. The study of meditation in the Hermetic tradition, specifically in this case from the 60 skills system, or from initiation to Hermetics by Franz Barden, fills this void. So why would a Wiccan want to study the 60 skills curriculum or Hermetics in general? Well, as was mentioned earlier, most ceremonial magic associated with Wicca is in fact ritual in nature. By studying an internal power system, it gives you more stuff to work with. Now this occurs through a threefold process. First, you train the mind, largely so you can focus and release better. Then you train energy, which allows you to get your hands on more of this subtle material that seems to power a lot of these ritual ceremonial functions. And finally, you also train the body in order to improve your throughput. Now, the great thing about Hermetics is that there isn't really a need to follow a specific philosophy associated with the actual meditative processes. They work just fine on their own. Now, what are these processes and how do they break down? Well, as was discussed earlier, first you learn how to control the mind. This allows you to focus and put your attention more concretely on things. This in turn will also improve your ceremonies by simply being more on point when you are performing one. Two, it improves your energy. Now in this case, depending upon how you choose to do it, not only can it move the inflow and outflow of energy through the body by greatly improving it, but it also gives you access to different kinds of energy that you might not have been able to access on your own previously. It also has concrete methods for unlocking your subtle senses in clairvoyance, clairsentience, and clairaudience, which again will allow you to communicate with the spirit world in a way that you may not have been able to before. Additionally, the body training results in not only improved health, but interestingly enough, improved energy. By improving these networks and pathways within the body physically, it turns out it also improves your energetic movement into and out of the body. Very curious. Also, more interestingly, by training the body in a specific manner, it also improves your mental energy or your ability to train and work with your mind. So, if you're a Wiccan and you've kind of reached a point with your practices and ceremonial magic where you're starting to experience what we call diminishing returns, where you would simply like to take things to the next step, learning proper meditative and yogic practice will greatly aid you in this pursuit. And of course, this being 60 skills, I recommend my system, but I would also suggest looking at Initiation to Hermetics by Franz Barden, as aside from ceremonial magic, again, largely typified by the Golden Dawn and Grimoire traditions, the Hermetics approach presented in Initiation to Hermetics by Franz Barden is the other great Western tradition in this regard, and you would gain a lot from it. So if you enjoyed today's lecture, hit the subscribe button down below and give us a like. And if you'd like to learn more about the 60 skills system of instruction, check out the details in the video down below. Be well.